Mm. So you want to date a stud in 2019. Okay, okay. You didn't came to the right channel. Let's get it. A nigga started from the bottom, now I'm living. Early morning, uncle whipping in the kitchen. Some people said I couldn't do it and I did it. Look at my bank account, I'm running up the digits. I ain't in all that doing ever saw shit. I walk it, I talk it, I live it. What is up, YouTube? It's your girl Reese, and I'm back with another video. As you can tell by the title, I'm going to be giving you guys five tips on how you can date a stud in 2019 successfully, okay? So if y'all ready, we're going to get right into the vid. Tip number one. You don't have to lie about your sexuality. It doesn't matter if you're bisexual, if you're lesbian, if you're straight. There's someone out there that's going to love you for who you are. If you lie in the beginning, it doesn't do anything but create an even bigger mess. You feel me? So just keep it 100 from the beginning. You ain't got a lot of kicking. There's studs out there that prefer straight women. There's studs out there that prefer a straight lesbian women. And then there's studs like me that's going to fuck all three. You feel? Period. That should make you feel better about it. You don't gotta lie. I know that there's constantly shade being thrown towards the bisexual women, but all in all, that shit doesn't matter. If you bisexual and that person love you, y'all gonna make it work regardless. So fuck all that. Keep it a hundred. Tip number two. You will get your soul Snitched, you feel me? Yaga. I'm sorry I gotta be the one to break it to you, but everybody knows lesbian sex is way better than straight sex. Straight sex, you might get one nut. Lesbian sex, you might get nine nuts, you know it? <laughs> hey, look, if you know, then you know. Prepare to get your soul fucking snatched out. I'm only telling you this so you don't jump into no relationship with no stud and she blow your mind, got your head gone and you fall in love the first night, you know? I'm, I'm giving you a heads up. And that brings me to another thing. If you've never had lesbian sex before, you ain't gotta lie about that either because us studs, we love to teach, okay? Facts. <laughs> we gonna teach you, we gonna show you, we gonna get you right, all right? So you ain't gotta be scared about never having lesbian sex before, you know? Cause we gonna teach you. Tip number three. Not all studs like being called daddy. Before you get to throwing words out, you need to understand who your partner is and what your partner likes because some studs really take offense to that. You know, they be like, daddy, do I look like your father? Do I look like a man? Like some, they really do trip off that shit so make sure you know the kind of stud that you're dealing with before you go throwing names out there all right facts tip number four the lesbian community is small as hell don't be surprised when you come across a shorty she didn't already dated all six of your exes the lesbian community is real small and The bitch probably gonna be passed around. It ain't her fault though. The lesbian community is growing. You know what I'm saying? I can I can say that. But for the most part, it's real small. And your ex then dated your other ex who's dated your sister's cousin's ex. Her ex, her other ex's ex then dated my ex. Whose ex dated my other ex's ex. Facts. Just understand that the lesbian community is small. And the last tip, tip number five. Y'all need to understand that us studs, we will break your heart just as bad, if not worse, as a nigga will. I feel like a lesbian heartbreak hurts worse than a straight, like a straight relationship heartbreak because two women in a relationship, I feel like they're more emotionally connected. So it's just... I don't know. I ain't making sense. If you if you feel me, then you feel me. We break your heart too. We got problems. We got human problems. We cheat. We lie. We do shit. There's some stuff out there that they cheat just as bad as as straight men. So don't think you're gonna get in a relationship with a lesbian and she gonna love you to death and she ain't gonna cheat and she gonna treat you right and she gonna blow your mind. Make sure you keep that in mind 
and that you're not jumping into the relationship for all the wrong reasons. So it's your girl Reese. I hope y'all enjoyed that little quick video. I know y'all like videos like this, so I had to make another one for y'all. Make sure y'all keep subscribing. I have been gaining like crazy. I have not been expecting a gain like this. I really fuck with y'all for fucking with me, all right? I just started this YouTube channel and I'm going up so fast, so I'll rock with y'all. Keep fucking subscribing, keep commenting. As you can see, I try to comment back um, to everybody. I, whoever comments, I always try to comment back. So go ahead and leave a comment. I don't care if it's con constructive criticism, if you got uh, another video idea, if my hair look crazy in this video, it don't matter. Just go ahead and comment right now. All right. I appreciate y'all. I'll see y'all in the next video. A nigga started from the bottom, now I'm living. Early morning, uncle whipping in the kitchen. Some people said I couldn't do it and I did it. Look at my bank account, I'm running up the digits. I ain't in all that doing that facade shit.